What's up guys, it's Dunsbrock for the attack, but you already know that, and I know it's been a while, but you know, life, and all that stuff, but you know, on to what you guys care about. The next character for the runes breakdown is Absa. Just a quick reminder, at max level, you have 8 spaces to fill with your runes. Mix and match to your heart's content, but remember, there is no reason not to fill up every single space. Now with that, let's get on to the rune. Rune A. Down tilt stuns opponents. Rune B. Down special has a decreased charge time. Rune C. Forward special is faster. Rune D. Up special travels farther and faster. Rune E, you get an additional double jump. Rune F, sweet spotting clouds does not destroy them. Rune G, uncharged neutral special teleports you to a cloud. Rune H, up special does not lead into special fall. Rune I. Charge down special isn't removed when you're hit. Rune J. Clouds spike opponents whenever they're placed or popped. Rune K. Clouds automatically pop on contact with an enemy. Rune L. More than one cloud can be placed on the screen. Rune M. Strong aerials have a larger hitbox. Rune N. Charge down special bolt lasts longer. Rune O. Down special trap the opponents for the final hit. Now, I'm going to do a basic overview of Absa, you know, sort of like the same thing I do with Forest Burn. Because there's not really a lot to talk about her runes. All her runes are actually really solid. Like, these are one that, like, Absa is a solid character for Abyss runes. Or, wait. But Absa is a solid character for Abyss mode. She, like, there's so many things good about her, and, like, there's not a lot bad at all that I could say. You could run her in multiple different ways. Well, most of her runes is, like, centered around her cloud. There's a lot of runes that isn't. So, you know, if you don't want to use the cloud, like, personally, I don't like to use her cloud a lot. There's a lot of runes that can do everything or anything you want to do with Absa. As long as you know you're good with Absa, you will find that she's a solid character. She doesn't live too long. She does do a lot of clear. But here's one thing. Rune O is a must-have on Absa. Well... Oh, I'm like, like I said, you can run her out any way you want. But it is a must-have in the sense of literally it kills every and anything at all. And it's perfect if your team is just setting up for a certain wave and you just set up in a corner or you need something. You can put it around yourself. You can place a cloud and put it around the cloud. Because once the enemies get trapped in it, there is no escape and they will die. It is so good. And Absa is so solid in literally every single aspect you want to use her as. Uh, so, you know, I am I guess I'm throwing away the little ranking systems, but yeah, I'm just going to say that she's actually just really, really good. Like, she's a perfect character as long as you know how to, you know, use her, like, basically. And that's the end of my video. Like I said, it's been a while, but I finally took the time to finish off getting everybody to level 10, which was really really tedious but I did it because sometimes I oh, remember I have to always test out it by itself then with group members of two three and four I just get really really detailed in my research and testing so you know that's how I know you know all these characters when I make these room videos that I'm basing something behind them but besides all that if you enjoy the video please leave a like subscribe because the other two is coming out in like the next week and subscribe for more videos. I've been Dims, and thank you for watching.